Scientists warn polar vortex will freeze the entire U.S. in 2025. Forecasters are predicting a severe polar vortex for early 2025, with temperatures expected to plunge to record lows across the United States. According to meteorological reports, this event may bring the coldest January since 2011, affecting millions from the Midwest to the Gulf Coast. States that rarely see freezing conditions, such as Florida, are bracing for uncharacteristic cold, while northern regions prepare for deep freezes and heavy snowfall. Today, we're taking a closer look into what this polar vortex could mean for weather patterns, daily life, and the economy. Understanding the Polar Vortex The polar vortex is a large area of low pressure and cold air surrounding the Earth's poles. This system, which usually remains stable and confined to the Arctic region, can occasionally weaken, causing frigid air to spill southward into lower latitudes. When this happens, it disrupts typical weather patterns and leads to extreme cold outbreaks in areas that are otherwise temperate during winter. The jet stream, a fast-moving current of air high in the atmosphere, plays a critical role in directing the movement of the polar vortex. When the jet stream weakens or becomes erratic, it allows pockets of cold air to break away from the polar region and move toward continents like North America and Europe. Historically, polar vortex disruptions have caused some of the most memorable cold snaps in U.S. history. The 2014 polar vortex, for instance, brought dangerously low temperatures and widespread disruptions across much of the country. Similar events occurred in 2019, where parts of the Midwest experienced wind chills below minus 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Meteorologists warn that the upcoming 2025 event could rival or even surpass the severity of those previous occurrences. With projections of sub-zero wind chills and Arctic blasts reaching as far south as Texas and Florida, experts stress the importance of understanding how this phenomenon works and what to expect. The frequency of polar vortex disruptions has drawn attention from scientists who are studying whether climate change may play a role. Some theories suggest that the rapid warming of the Arctic weakens the stability of the vortex, making these events more frequent and severe. While debate continues, one thing is certain. Polar vortex disruptions can have a significant impact on millions of people, affecting everything from transportation and energy supplies to agriculture and public health. The 2025 Polar Vortex Forecast Meteorologists have issued a stark warning about the intensity of the polar vortex expected to hit the United States in early 2025. The cold wave is predicted to affect nearly every region, with temperatures plummeting well below seasonal averages. The most intense period of cold is forecast between January 7th and January 14th, when Arctic air masses will likely dominate much of the country. Weather models indicate that this outbreak will lead to widespread disruptions, including heavy snow, icy conditions, and dangerously low wind chills in many areas. Regions across the Midwest and Great Plains are expected to endure some of the harshest conditions, with temperatures plunging 20 to 30 degrees below normal. Wind chill values could dip to life-threatening levels, increasing the risk of frostbite and hypothermia for anyone exposed to the elements for extended periods. In the Northeast, forecasts suggest a high probability of significant snowstorms, which may impact major metropolitan areas. Residents of the South are also preparing for unusual weather, with freezing temperatures anticipated in places as far south as Florida. Citrus growers and farmers in the region are particularly concerned about the potential damage to crops, given that such extreme cold events can cause widespread agricultural losses. The comparison to past polar vortex events paints a concerning picture. While cold waves are not uncommon during winter, the severity and reach of this event could make it one of the most disruptive in recent memory. Experts have pointed out that it may rival the polar vortex of 2014, which caused billions in economic damages and overwhelmed energy grids across several states. The situation underscores the need for heightened preparedness and vigilance as the cold wave approaches. Regional Impacts of the Polar Vortex 
The impending polar vortex is expected to deliver severe weather conditions across multiple regions in the United States, each facing unique challenges due to varying climates and infrastructure. In the Midwest, where brutal winter conditions are more common, the forecast calls for blizzard-like conditions and dangerously low temperatures. Cities such as Chicago, Minneapolis, and Detroit are bracing for significant snowfall, with strong winds likely to create whiteout conditions and hazardous travel. The combination of heavy snow and ice could lead to widespread power outages, leaving many without heat in sub-zero temperatures. Local authorities are urging residents to prepare for extended periods of extreme cold by stocking up on essential supplies and ensuring their homes are well insulated. In the Northeast, similar concerns are being raised as major population centers may experience severe snowstorms and freezing rain. Urban areas like New York City, Boston, and Philadelphia are likely to face significant transportation delays, particularly in air and rail travel. Coastal regions are also preparing for the possibility of storm surges and coastal flooding, which can occur when winter storms coincide with high tides. The demand for heating oil and natural gas is expected to surge, placing additional strain on energy infrastructure. Southern states, known for their milder winters, will face an unusual challenge as the cold wave is predicted to reach as far south as Texas and Florida. This poses a serious risk to agriculture, particularly in Florida, where the citrus industry is a vital part of the state's economy. Prolonged freezing temperatures can damage fruit crops, leading to significant financial losses for farmers. Additionally, many areas in the South are not equipped to handle extreme cold, making infrastructure failures and power outages more likely. Cities in these regions have begun coordinating emergency response plans, aiming to prevent a repeat of the 2021 Texas freeze, which left millions without power during a similar cold snap. The widespread nature of this event means that nearly every region in the country will experience some degree of disruption. With cold-related risks spanning from power outages to travel delays and agricultural losses, preparedness is essential for minimizing the overall impact of the polar vortex. Economic and energy sector implications, the polar vortex forecast for 2025 is raising significant concerns about its potential economic toll. Historically, extreme cold events have caused disruptions across key sectors, including energy, transportation, and agriculture. With temperatures expected to plunge well below average across much of the country, demand for energy is likely to skyrocket. Households and businesses will require more heating, leading to a surge in natural gas and heating oil consumption. Market analysts have already noted a sharp rise in natural gas prices in anticipation of the cold wave. If prolonged, this demand spike could create additional volatility in energy markets, driving up costs for consumers and straining power grids. One of the biggest risks posed by this polar vortex is the potential for power outages. Many regions, particularly in the South, have infrastructure that is not designed to withstand prolonged freezing temperatures. During a similar event in the 2021, Texas experienced widespread blackouts when the state's power grid failed under the pressure of extreme cold. This time, Grid operators in vulnerable areas are working to implement preventative measures, but questions remain about whether these preparations will be sufficient. Even in regions with robust energy infrastructure, the sheer scale of the cold wave may challenge the reliability of supply, especially if ice and snow damage transmission lines. Beyond the energy sector, the agricultural industry stands to suffer significant losses. Freezing temperatures in southern states, especially Florida and Texas, could decimate crops like citrus fruits, avocados, and vegetables. This not only impacts local farmers, but also disrupts supply chains across the country, leading to higher prices for consumers. In past events, extreme cold has caused billions of dollars in agricultural losses, and the current forecast suggests that similar outcomes may be inevitable. Additionally, disruptions to transportation, including road closures and delayed freight shipments, could further hamper the flow of goods 
adding to economic pressures. The financial burden of such an event extends to households already facing high utility costs. With energy bills expected to rise, many families may struggle to keep their homes adequately heated. Charitable organizations and local governments are preparing to offer assistance, but the scale of the need could overwhelm resources. The economic impact of the polar vortex will likely ripple through multiple sectors, underscoring the importance of both short-term preparedness and long-term infrastructure resilience in the face of extreme weather. Preparedness and Safety Measures As the 2025 polar vortex looms, officials are urging individuals, businesses, and communities to take necessary precautions to mitigate its potential effects. The National Weather Service has issued warnings about the risks posed by extreme cold, particularly frostbite and hypothermia, which can occur in minutes under severe wind chill conditions. People living in affected regions are being advised to prepare their homes by sealing drafts, ensuring heating systems are functioning properly, and stocking up on essential supplies, such as food, water, and warm clothing. Local governments are setting up warming centers for those who may not have adequate heating, offering a vital resource for vulnerable populations. Transportation safety is also a primary concern. Ice-covered roads and poor visibility from snow and wind can make driving treacherous, leading to accidents and delays. Authorities are urging residents to avoid unnecessary travel during the coldest and stormiest periods. Airlines and rail services are preparing for potential cancellations and delays as major hubs brace for harsh winter conditions. Maintaining clear roads and infrastructure will be critical to ensuring emergency services can operate without interruption. Energy providers have stepped up their efforts to prepare for the anticipated surge in demand. Many are conducting maintenance on power lines and equipment to reduce the risk of outages, particularly in areas that experienced grid failures during previous cold waves. Residents are being encouraged to conserve energy where possible, such as lowering thermostats during peak usage hours to prevent overloading the grid. Despite these efforts, experts caution that extreme conditions could still lead to localized power failures, so having backup sources of heat and light is recommended. The focus on preparedness extends to businesses, especially those involved in critical services like health care and food supply. Hospitals are reviewing emergency protocols to ensure they can continue operating during potential power outages, while grocery stores and suppliers are working to maintain inventories in case of delivery disruptions. The polar vortex serves as a reminder of the importance of being ready for sudden severe weather changes. By taking proactive measures, individuals and communities can reduce the risks and hardships brought on by this extreme weather event. Now it's time to hear from you. What scares you about the polar vortex? Let us know in the comments section below.